Well, good afternoon, Pine Belt. We're back for another Wild Wednesday, and I gotta say, I've got a new one for me here, one I haven't heard of. So I've got Stephanie, she's gonna introduce us to a tegu. Uh, so once again, this is a new animal for me, and I'm no Ooh. zoologist, but I'm aware of animals, and I've never heard of this one. Yeah. Uh, so this is Eliza, she's our Argentine tegu. Um, so these guys are in the monitor family. Um, so they're related to Komodo dragons and things like that. So they are uh, meat-eating predator lizards. Okay, yeah. Komodo dragons I have heard of. They're <laughs> a little bit bigger than the tegu, oh, right? Oh yeah, yeah, quite a, quite a little bit, yeah. Um, so she is a female, so she's a little bit smaller, um, but they do have that beautiful black and white patterning. Um, helps them kind of camouflage under, you know, shadowy leaves and things. Um, and if you'll check out her tongue, uh, so you think of the lizards and things that we have around here, the anoles and the geckos, they have a rounded tongue, which they do use to smell. Uh, but these guys have that forked tongue like a snake does. Um, which helps them kind of determine exactly where a smell is coming from and they can smell different smells better so these guys are looking for mammals and things like that whereas you know the lizards around here they're just looking for bugs not a stinky prey so these guys really need that that predator tongue to find uh, their prey. <laughs> Understood now you had mentioned there's some toys in the in the mm -hmm. pen here uh, that she's very active loves playing with this ball rolling around with it kind of a little bit quiet today is that it's a, a little, it's is a little a, early it's needs a little to early warm up the day. yeah it needs to warm up needs to get some sunshine we just woke her up so i'd be doing the same thing if you just woke me up and put a camera in front of me so she's just kind of chilling right now she'll be way more active uh, as it warms up and as she gets some sun in her it's definitely something i deal with every single day as many of our viewers do for sunrise who are up before the sun starts <laughs> shining so beautiful animal here again one that i didn't know anything about until we walked in so is there anything unique you'd really like to share about this animal um, so these guys actually, believe it or not, are common in the pet trade. Um, she, Eliza here was a former pet. They got her, realized they'd made a mistake. Uh, these guys require a lot of room. Like I said, they're meat eaters. They can be very feisty. They can be aggressive. They are a carnivore. Um, so just really do your research before you get a pet. A lot of our animals here at the zoo are former pets and we can only take in so many that y'all don't want. So please do your research. So I'll go ahead and let you guys get back to it. And you guys have a good Wild Wednesday. Stay wild. This week's Wild Wednesday is brought to you by Rainforest Car Wash and the Hattiesburg Zoo.